Welcome to Psychological Speaks, your trusted source for insights into human behavior and relationships. Today, we are discussing a topic that resonates with many how to make someone who left you start chasing you again. It might sound impossible, but there are psychological tactics that can turn the tables. Stick around to discover two powerful things you can do to rekindle their interest. 1. Focus on self-improvement. The first step to making someone chase you again is to focus on becoming the best version of yourself. This involves several key aspects. Physical appearance take care of your health and fitness. When you look good, you feel good, and this newfound confidence will be noticeable to others. Mental and emotional growth engage in activities that stimulate your mind and enhance your emotional well-being. This could include reading, taking up a new hobby, or practicing mindfulness and meditation. Career and personal goals work towards achieving your personal and professional goals. Success and ambition are attractive qualities that can make you more appealing to others. When you focus on self-improvement, you not only become more attractive but also shift the focus from the person who left you to your own growth and happiness. This change in attitude can be incredibly magnetic. 2. Create distance and mystery. The second crucial tactic is to create a sense of distance and mystery. Here's how. Limiting contact resists the urge to reach out or respond immediately to their messages. Give them space to miss you and wonder about you. Being less available fill your schedule with activities that interest you. When you are busy and less available, it makes you more intriguing and desirable. Social media presence use social media to your advantage by subtly showcasing your exciting and fulfilling life. Post pictures of yourself having fun, achieving goals, and enjoying new experiences. By creating distance, you allow the person to experience the void you left in their life. This absence can often make them realize your value and reignite their interest in you. 3. Focus on self-improvement. The first and most essential step to reigniting someone's interest in you is to focus on self-improvement. When someone leaves, it often leads to self-doubt and insecurity. But the secret to turning this situation around is to pour all that energy into becoming the best version of yourself. This will not only make you more attractive to the other person, but will also increase your self-confidence and overall happiness. Let's break down the areas of self-improvement you should focus on. Physical appearance, there's no denying that physical attraction plays a significant role in relationships, but this isn't just about looking good for others. Taking care of your physical health by adopting better fitness routines and eating healthier can do wonders for your confidence. When you feel good about your body, you radiate confidence, and that confidence will be apparent to everyone around you, including the person who left. Consider activities like joining a gym, taking up yoga, or even something as simple as going for daily walks. Grooming yourself, dressing in a way that makes you feel powerful, and carrying yourself with pride can transform the way you're perceived. A mental and emotional growth, just as important as physical improvement, is mental and emotional development. Emotional resilience is incredibly attractive, because it shows that you can handle life's ups and downs with grace. This is where you should focus on strengthening your mind and emotions. Read books that challenge your thinking, dive into new hobbies that excite you, or take up a course to learn something you've always been interested in. Additionally, practicing mindfulness, meditation, or journaling can help you manage your emotions more effectively, reduce anxiety, and cultivate a stronger sense of inner peace. The more emotionally stable and mentally sharp you are, the more attractive you will appear to others. Career and personal goals, there is nothing more attractive than someone who is passionate about their personal and professional ambitions. Focus on advancing in your career or setting personal goals for yourself. Maybe it's earning a promotion, launching a side business, or simply pursuing a long-held passion. Ambition and success not only elevate your self-team, but also signal to others that you are driven and capable. When the person who left you sees you thriving in your life without them, they'll be reminded of your value and may find themselves drawn back to you. The bottom line is that focusing on self-improvement shifts your attention away from the person who left and back to your own well-being. This newfound focus on yourself is powerful. It recharges your energy and confidence, and this change in attitude is magnetic. You become the best version of yourself not just for them, but for you, and that authenticity will naturally draw them closer. 4. Create Distance and Mystery 
The second powerful tactic you need to employ is creating a sense of distance and mystery. When someone leaves you, the instinctive reaction might be to chase after them, to over-communicate, or to constantly remind them of your presence. However, this approach often backfires, pushing them further away. Instead, creating space is essential in reigniting their interest. Distance allows both of you to gain perspective, and it leaves room for curiosity and longing to develop. Here's how you can create that irresistible sense of mystery. Limiting contact, one of the hardest but most effective steps is to limit your contact with the person who left. This means no excessive texting, calling, or checking in on them. If they reach out, resist the urge to respond immediately. Give them the chance to miss you. By limiting contact, you create a void in their life and absence that they will begin to notice. In the silence, they might start to wonder what you're doing, whether you've moved on or if they made the right decision in leaving. This kind of curiosity is a powerful tool in making them rethink their choices. Being less available another crucial aspect of creating distance is becoming less available in general. This doesn't mean you should be rude or ignore them completely, but it's about filling your schedule with activities that interest you. Start saying yes to plans with friends, family, or new social events. Engage in your hobbies, sign up for a new class, or take that trip you've always dreamed of. When they see that you are genuinely busy and enjoying life without them, it becomes clear that you are not waiting around. Being unavailable shows them that you are independent and living a fulfilling life, which can make you even more desirable. Social media presence in today's digital age, social media is an effective tool for subtly creating intrigue. Use your social media presence to your advantage by showcasing your exciting and fulfilling life. Post photos of yourself having fun with friends, achieving personal or professional goals, or enjoying new experiences. However, be careful not to overdo it. Your posts should feel natural and not staged for the purpose of making them jealous. When they see you living your best life, it will spark curiosity and perhaps even a bit of regret. They'll wonder why they left someone who is clearly thriving, and this can reignite their interest in you. By creating distance, you allow the person to reflect on what life without you really feels like. That absence will often make them realize the value you brought to their life, leading them to reconsider their decision and chase after you. The Conclusion Reversing the dynamic and making someone who left you chase you again isn't about manipulation or games, it's about refocusing your energy inward and becoming a more empowered version of yourself. The key is to make genuine changes for your own growth and happiness. By focusing on self-improvement, you increase your value and radiate confidence, which is irresistibly attractive. Creating distance and mystery only amplifies this effect, as it gives them the space to miss you and wonder about the incredible person they walked away from. Remember, your primary goal should always be to improve yourself for your own sake, not just to win someone back. If they start chasing you again, it's a bonus. What truly matters is that you emerge from this experience stronger, more confident, and more in control of your own life. If they don't come back, you'll still be better off because you've invested in yourself and your future. Thank you for watching Psychological Speaks. If you found this video helpful, Please take a moment to like, share, and subscribe for more valuable insights on relationships, psychology, and self-growth. Until next time, take care of yourself, stay confident, and never stop becoming the best version of you.